Hello everyone. In today's video, we are going to talk about while loop in Bash. So this is my script file in that I'll show you that how you can write while loop and how you can execute them. This is the structure of our while loop. First of all, you will write here keyword while and in the braces, we'll write our condition. As soon as this condition is true, we'll have our do section. Basically in our do section, we'll write the statement that we want to perform or we want to print out onto our terminal if this condition is true. As soon as this condition gets failed, we want to terminate our while loop and to terminate our while loop, we have a keyword as done. Now I'll show you an example that how you can use your while loop. First of all, I'll declare a variable as var equals zero, means variable has value as zero. Now in my while, I will write here dollar sign var, it means dollar sign shows here we are going to use a variable in here space hyphen le it means less than and equals i will write here five so my condition is until and unless variable is less than and equal to five keep executing while loop what we want to execute we'll write that one into our do section i will write here echo space inverted commas basically i want to write a string here i will write here number is colon space and after my inverted commas or my string, I will call my variable, which was var. So I will again write here dollar sign var and we are good to go. So in order to make this condition fail or in order to make your while loop stop at some point, we have to make something that will force this condition to get failed. So for that purpose, I will come to next line. I will write here var plus plus. So as soon as our while loop gets executed for the first time, we'll have an increment in this value. So we'll get 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And as soon as after the fifth iteration, we'll get the sixth value, this condition will get failed. And because of that, our while loop will get terminated. So that is why we have written here var plus plus. Now I'll head back to my terminal and now I'll execute this file. So I will just save this one. I'll open my terminal and I will write here bash space script dot sh hit enter. So here, if you see here, it says number is zero, one, two, three, four, five. So basically we just wanted to do just like that in here. So here we have five values and zero is the sixth one. That is why we have six outputs. So as soon as we'll get sixth value, this loop will get terminated and we'll have six answers onto our screen. So this is how you can use your while loop into your bash. This is not the only way. You can use some other things in your while loop as well. For example, if you want to include for loop with your while loop, you can do so. If you want to add your if else statement or switch statement or any other thing into your while loop, you can do so. But make sure you do all of those things under the do keyword section. Only then those will be executable. And that brings us to the end of this video. We'll see you in the next one. Till then, take care.